go, my minions. Soon all Patriot City will be in my frozen grasp. Not so fast, Snowball. You do not recognize me, fools? Good golly! It's Sukov! Behold the transformative power of Energy X. <laughs> These capitalists will make excellent trophies for my Dacha. Prepare them for the journey to the motherland. Is that the end for Minuteman and his mysterious ally? Is there no one who can save the heroic duo? No one can save you now. Those meddling heroes are on their way to Moscow. Time for a little baked Alaska. Who? What? You can call me El Diablo. And you, Paquita, call me El Guapo. Ooh. A fiery newcomer. Perhaps he can free our freeze-dried heroes. Aye, pretty calls. A hero's work is never done. El Guapo. I never did discover what that meant. Greetings, good viewer. This is the Skyrider. And if you'll excuse me, El Diablo needs to save this civilian from being shot. Because the ice troopers are just bastards like that. Oh, fucker. This is the annoying thing about El Diablo, is that he's good, and he can do a lot of damage when he can hit the target. There, so you one hit KO. Simple. There we go. If you actually do what I, you know, am saying you to do, Diablo tends to help. Thank you very much, sir. Right. Narrator, please advise us with your markers. Some characters have the ability to fly. Use the Fly 2 command to get El Diablo into the air. Note that your energy replenishes more slowly while flying. Result bubbles can give you more information about your target. A blue result bubble means they are resistant to your attacks, while a red bubble means they are vulnerable. Mira, here comes Just Thanks. free. Whoever you are. Our friendly neighborhood police officers, and we'll make our way up the path. Uh, I would just like to take this moment to say that in absolutely no way whatsoever is El Diablo the Human Torch. I mean, come on. That's just silly to suggest that. Why would he be the Human Torch? I mean, why? Just makes no sense. So we'll grab this health canister before facing this pair of ice queens, because the trouble is, whichever way you do this with Diablo, it's going to hurt. If you don't, well probably going to hurt at least. He is handsome for a capitalist. Attack! Come hey on, ladies, Diablo. Hit nice, for once. Boom, good Diablo. man. Run, run from the giant rock. I hate giant rocks. Yes, this is the problem when you face the Ice Queens, and it's a very irritating ability of the Ice Queens, is that if they, if they can't hit you with their melee attacks, they'll use their great strength to pick up large objects and throw them at you, and will most likely one hit one shot you if you're not careful. So I will try to use tongues of flame, but I've a nasty suspicion that this is going to fail hard. Let's start no, run, run. Oh bitch, just throw the damn rock already. Ow. Well that did far less damage than I thought it would. But yes, that's what that uh, is what can happen. Let's start and in response, I burn you. And forty three damage. For Let's start nice. Well done. I didn't die on that for once. Mira, here comes trouble. Free minute man. Thanks for the help, friend. Not so fast with that friend stuff. Who's behind the Winter Wonderland? A Russian spy who calls himself Nuclear Winter. Yeah, and who are you supposed to be? George Washington? Just another concerned citizen, friend. A citizen who knows that someone so powerful and brave would not stand idly by while the beautiful young women of this city are in peril. Ay, caramba, you really know how to hit a fellow where it hurts. Let's go melt us a snowman. I like Mentor! Free him, Diablo! I like... Crack this one open. Mm, thank you, gentlemen. I like how Minute Man knows instantly what Diablo's personality is, regardless of only having met him for two seconds. Here they come. There we go, Mentor. You are now free, sir. I congratulate you, Earthling. You bear the mark of Energy X. Energy who? All will become clear. Nuclear winter awaits. 
Their simple minds reveal their secrets. The source of this frigid villainy is in the pump house. We must locate that building and destroy it. Careful with those tanks of liquid nitrogen. Quickly, fools. We must get these to nuclear winter. Get them on the truck liquid nitrogen. and we'll take them to the pump house. Liquid ice? Pump house? I bet that's how they froze on the park. Time for some Diablo destruction. Through the trees as we avoid the ice beams. Sounds like some sort of holiday activity. Nice one, min uh, Minuteman, that's the one, that's what you're called. So we'll move in close for these gentlemen. Psyche Slash. That's you gone. And that's you gone. Good job, team. You see, aren't things so much better when you work together? Simply because you don't have to wait for five minutes for certain characters to unfreeze Diablo. Heish. Ooh, hang about. We'll stun him. Good shot, Minute Man. Your evil is here. That's it. Uh, ice troopers. Now you're truly even, in that you're all attacking each other. Share the pain, just like you communists share everything. Uh Political banter, don't you just love it? Come on, Diablo. Ah. See, as I said, Diablo is good. I do like Diablo, don't get me wrong, but his accuracy really does... Or lack of it, rather, really can piss me off at times. Yes, for Patriot City. There we go. When all else fails, whack things with... With things. Whacking things with other things. It's a proven uh, method of destruction. Proven to work very well, from what I understand. Come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away. Burn. Excellent. I believe that's everybody. Now, we will destroy the pump house, which is resistant to just about everything, except for energy. So, mental psyche slash it hopefully do a lot of damage. There, see? Boom. Right, Diablo, now even you can't miss this barn door. You may have needed one damage, but you hit it, Diablo, and that's the important thing. That's it, team. Keep going. Keep smashing things in the face. Because we all know buildings have faces. I mean, they do, right? Or is that just me? Uh, maybe it's just me. It often is. With most things, in fairness. Come on, Minute Man, stop jumping about. Whack the blasted thing. Come on, it's a pump house, it's evil. Come on, come on. Come on, keep going. And again, and again. There we go. Thank you, Minute Man. The fools have gotten free. Attack, comrades. If we're such yes. fools, then how did we get free? Huh? Huh? <laughs> uh oh. See, this is exactly what I mean. I should have got Diablo to land first. Because now we're having cars chucked at us. Ow! See? That was incredibly painful. And what can quite easily happen if you're not careful. Fortunately, we can have other people deal with this. Right, madam. Minute Man will deal with you. In the meantime, you'll do that. And Diablo, you can go in there. You'll just have to heal yourself. Heroic Remedy, excellent. That's what they're there for. Well done, Minute Man. No more fighting. I shall talk. That's why he's great. That's why he's the fearless leader. And Diablo's just there to talk to the women. I lie, he's there to burn stuff as well, and he's very good at that. But his inaccuracy just gets gets on my nerves. So, Ice Queen, tell us where nuclear winter has gone. Ready for duty. To the new empowered Freedom Force. Where's nuclear winter? Rattle on, fool. The master is escaping with the nuclear warhead as we speak. Nuclear warhead? Nobody said nothing about nuclear warheads. 
Of course, the fleet is in town. He could only have taken it from the aircraft carrier down at the docks. Let's move. Excellent. So, let's look at uh, objectives completed. All enemies destroyed. The pump house was destroyed. And, yep, that's the prestige we got from the previous mission. Excellent. Now, before we finish this video off, I will pose you this question, good viewer. Why does Nuclear Winter wear a fur coat? Aside from the obvious uh, Russian stereotype that he's uh, clearly portraying, why does he need to wear a coat? It just seems unnecessary. But uh, I prattle on once again, good viewer. Uh, thank you very mu much for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, offer me your thoughts, should you so wish. I'm always happy to try and improve myself and my abilities. Uh, so, ladies and gentlemen, thank you once again. This has been the Skyrider. Farewell until we meet again.